Hey guys and girls and welcome back to Medieval Kingdoms 12, 12 AD. We are picking up where we left off in the last episode. We finally took Veron and also we also got declared war by the Latin uh, Empire. So we are at war with them. We are kind of semi rebuilding our army. We're going to be moving this army down south. The other thing I was looking at doing is maybe doing a bit of, where are we? We want to go force details? Yes. Uh, execute deserters, just to get our integrity up. That should be okay for one turn. Won't be uh, too bad. And we're going to do it for this army as well. That should boost that up to quite a fair bit. We won't lose too many troops out of there, so that's a good thing. Um, there is a bit of a food shortage in Verone, which is okay. Not much we can do about it. Defenders of the Faith. Uh, you know what? I'm not too worried about you guys being up there either. The other thing we also did, I believe, is... Yeah, we also became... Oh, we also got peace with the Holy Roman Empire as well. So that is all good. We don't need to protect our northern borders quite yet. They could turn around and attack us. However, we are not making a lot of money, which is not good. That's mainly because we spent a lot of it just trying to repair this. Can we repair it? We can, which is good. That's everything there. Public order is okay. I don't mind keeping that public order up high. Um, okay, we should be alright. It's mainly the food. So we're going to have to probably... Uh, what is that? Public order... That's... Hmm. 110. You know what? We're not going to repair... It. We're gonna hold on because I just want to see if this will give us enough food for everything to be sorted out because if that's the case We got better things uh, to spend this money on than just repairing that building and if it doesn't well We might look at destroying it if we don't need it. That's all so let's end there Okay, we do have a point down here. Here's our governor, which is fine construction can be sorted out for a point And let's just throw the other in um I don't know, there's, uh, we could go down here, public order, integrity, not really important for the integrity, but the public order would be quite useful anyway. Uh, oh, we gotta go, commander, okay, fair enough, that's okay. And that's all good there, like I said, we got no other money, and we'll just finish the turn. So hopefully the Latin Empire doesn't do anything too stupid. We will, like I said, probably get our armies down here and then move across by sea. And continue to expand. Hopefully we can take Constantinople. Because that would be quite nice. I may see if they will accept peace as well first of. Because if we don't have to fight them, that'll be great. That'd be really good actually, to tell you the truth. Um, that's fine. Uh, not much here for us. The Fifth Crusade was defeated and a new pope was elected. That's fine, okay. Cool. So first things first, let's go diplomacy. And Greetings what about peace? The name of the state and okay, they're not going to accept peace. That's fine. If that's what you don't want to occur, that's okay. So they do have two armies moving up. Uh, they're not full stacks, which is good for us. And insufficient manpower. They're suffering there. Insufficient manpower. So they're not recovering their troops, which is okay. I just gotta be careful of where I deploy my troops. Okay, I think we're gonna move this army down here. And let's go fortification. Um, they look like one's going for Trenko, the other one's moving around here, that's if that's the case. So we may need to actually move this army down a little bit further. That's fine there. Public order should be okay there. Yeah, it's back to pretty much normal. Public order sh is fine here. So we're gonna move this army a bit down south as well. Uh, okay, we're gonna move this down further and you guys go down here. Okay. Cool. We also get support from these guys as well, which is okay. Like I said, them having two armies is a bit of a pain in the ass. Okay, food is okay with that. So let's look at converting this building then. What can we get out of this that would be useful for us? Um, public order, no, not food consumption. 
Uh, I think we're going to destroy it, I reckon. Because what we do want to get is sanitation. Uh, under control next. Okay. So we are going to go and destroy it. That saved us actually a little bit of money, which is quite nice. We could maybe look at building a third army, but I think we're just going to hold off, to tell you the truth. Um, hmm. So you're okay there. You're okay there. Squalor is a bit of a pain in the butt here, which we can sort out quite easily. So we're going to increase the slots. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Okay, we are back. We have increased the slot. So everything over there is good and dandy. We've expanded it out so we can get up to, I think, 10 slots. So that's not too bad. That will help us out quite a lot. Like I so said, we do have some squall issues in other places, but that's okay. What do we need to get that? How many turns for that? Seven turns, then I think we do... Uh... Then we need nine and then there. Okay. So we're going to finish off this research. And then we're going to go up and do mendicant orders. And then go, uh, what is it? Scholarism. And that will help us boost our, well, our squalor. So which is good. Because everywhere is kind of not great. So he's breaking even. That's okay. You'll you're fine there. Okay. So we do have a bit of a squalor issue, but that's okay. What is that army if they do attack here? Ew, not a whole lot. But they won't be able to attack straight away unless they got siege equipment. So we should be okay. Um, who are you? You're a governor as well. We're going to do two points in construction. So that gets it down quite cheap, which is quite good for us. 27, 20% 20 off. That's really good. Okay, what are you going to do? Now me trying to gauge which direction they're facing is just... It was just a guess. I have no idea where they're going. And for all I know, well, they've just disappeared. So for all I know, they've pulled back off the map. So that's okay. Um, so we'll probably send our army across. Faction destroyed. Not really caring about that. Okay, so by the looks of it... The Latin Empire is at war with the Kingdom of Serbia, which is fine for us. That helps us out a lot. The more enemies you have, the better for us. Okay, so we're going to probably march for this settlement here. This will give us a bit of a foothead as well. Okay, so we're going to move... Hmm. We're fine there. Public order is down here, but that's okay. We can sort that out. I'll leave that building there to tell you the truth. Or we could get another army. We're going to raise another army, I reckon. Nothing too major. It's going to cost us 700 and 373, which is fine. And this is just going to allow us to put... Well, we can't do that yet. We're just going to put a very small army into Verone. And this army will be pretty much just going up and down the coast, uh, protecting where we need to. Okay, so you're fine there. Let's move you into there. That's okay. Uh, we can't send you anywhere else but there, which is fine. We're going to go force and we're going to execute some stragglers as well. Try and get this boosted up to 100 pretty much. You're 82. You're okay as well. Replenishment will take a turn, which is fine. Okay. We do have a bit of money, but I think we're going to hold off on it. Uh, just try and build up a bit of a reserve. Because there's no point. What's our squalor like here? Plus five, okay. Uh, Navy recruitment, not going to be useful. Squalor, public order, we get a bit more food. Bit of money out of that. Growth, wealth... We'd we'll probably go fishing docks for what is it, three and a half almost. I think we're going to hold off to it just in case we need to recruit some more troops, which is fine. So we're going to end the turn. Like I said, once this decimation has occurred, 
depending what the Latin Empire decides to do, we're going to start moving out. We're going to take. Our wares have merits which would appeal to your people. You know what? And trade enriches all. Sure. For a second there, I thought they were declaring one war on us, but it's not. So yeah, we'll move up to Dirichium, whatever the pronunciation is of that settlement, and take it. Because like I said, it doesn't have walls by the looks of it. So that may be a good advantage for us. It could have walls, I just probably didn't see it. And the good thing is, by the looks of it, the Latin Empire is a bit busy everywhere else. Uh, no, it does have walls. Okay, fair enough. But I'm assuming it shouldn't be too bad. Now, before we do continue on, I just want to give it a quick gander around. Okay, so they got an army there, which is fine. Like, I could wait one turn. They're going to be three turns to replenish. Or we move out now. I think we're going to move on out now. So, let's get an army there. And... We're going to get an army there. Because I think the best bet... Oh, actually, we can land down here. We're going to land down here. Land down here and move on up north. I was going to land up here, but that's a bit too far away. Okay. Let's throw you in there. Public order is fine. Can we actually execute? Yeah, we're going to execute some people here. Uh, and that will sort that out as well. Cool. Okay, and I could probably get some troops as well, but I think we're going to hold off just a little bit. Okay, everything else is looking pretty damn good. Like I said, still just trying to build up a bit of a coffer. And let's end the turn again. And wait and see. So by the looks of it, who is this? Let's see if we can... We find our coffers temporarily empty. Seven... 700 gold for non-aggression pack. To make a contribution. Um, oh, it's the Kingdom of Hungary. Okay, they're actually quite large. That's fine. Uh, you know what? I'm going to accept it. I know it's going to cost us 700 gold, but just to kind of protect our northern borders, I'll accept it. Okay, so it is the Kingdom of Hungary then. That's okay. I was seeing who this was. I couldn't remember who it was, and it just looked like a one city uh, kingdom, which would have been quite easy just to take. Okay, they've seen what we're doing, which is fine. That's not going to help them. Like I said, we're going to move our army up here. Move our army up here. Can we get either of them? We can't get either of them into re ah, reinforcement. Uh, Four to five position. That's okay. So that's taken all of our movement, which is okay. We should be out of range. If they do attack us, they shouldn't be able to reinforce by the city. Uh, we got a bit of money, so maybe we look at expanding some of this. Okay. That's just going to increase squalor, which I don't really want to spend money on. So I think we're going to spend some money and get fishing docks. Squalor should be still under, which is fine. Uh, public order down by one, which is okay. So overall, not too bad. Like I said, it's going to take a bit of money, which is okay. I don't want to expand, because I can't remember if anything happens if we do expand and we don't build anything for a while, so. At your command. Ready for order. Okay. We're all good there. Let's end the turn and see what they decide to do. For all I know, they could have three armies there ready to move down and absolutely crush us, which wouldn't be a good thing. But then again, I did see an army over in Constantinople. So they've actually retreated their army. So I don't know if they're afraid or they got other issues to worry about. But like I said, this will give us a bit of a foothead. We can replenish our troops here. And then I respect the uh, I'm going to accept that as well. They're going to pay us 300 gold. So in the end, it only cost us 400 gold to get that um, non-aggression pact with uh, Austria. Commander. Okay. Commander. So the question is, who do we move in? I reckon these guys probably be the best bet. We're going to hold that there, which is okay. What are you doing over here? Uh, let's move you up here. See if you can 
get you out. How far away before you're too far away? About there. Okay. Didn't really help out too much, but that's okay. Um. So how many turns? Two turns to get enough towers to really crush them. Okay. Definitely going to do that. The good thing is they don't have a lot of archers, which will be good. Um, and it's only going to take two turns, which is fine. So everything else is looking pretty good. How long is that going to take? Three more turns. Okay. And what are we looking up like up here? Okay. Um, why? Why are you still negative one? Events. Taxes, disease, difficulty level. Okay. Don't want to get any mercenaries. I think getting... Are you ready to serve? It is a great and great two crossbowmen, two spearmen should be enough just to kind of resupport everything. And like I said, we can slowly build this out to another army, which is what we want to slowly do as well. Uh, that is actually going to cost us what though in the long run? 140, 140, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, Five and a, yeah, probably five hundred. So that's going to go down to about three hundred. So let's kind of build only what we need. We're only going to build two crossbow units, just enough to keep the public order under control wherever we go with this army. That's the main thing. That's all at the moment that we're trying to aim to do is just get public order under control using military force. So okay, so if these guys get attacked. We in. We can reinforce with this army here. Some in the state are known to have lavish tastes. I am happy to These accept that for the time being. 200 gold. Uh, that kind of protects them coming down and attacking us. You know, we're all good there. I don't, well, I'm not too worried about spending that amount of gold. Just to continue protecting certain flanks. So that kind of means since we're non-aggression with a lot of the factions along here, we may look east. Defamation. Ugh. Pay him off for 85. Um, we're just going to pay him off. Okay. We are going to try and take one province then. Since they are not happy. There's a bit of war wariness. Does that affect anything at the moment? No. Uh... Wariness. Morale. Negative one. Okay, that's okay for the time being. Ready for orders. Public order is fine here. Everything else is here. Ooh. Wasn't sanitation enough? Smallpox. Maybe that's uh, beyond our ability. Uh, that's fine. Okay. Still bringing 590 gold. That's okay. We are going to wait one more turn. We take this settlement. Just to get the extra... We only get one of each. I'd rather just two, and then we'll attack after that. Okay, so that's going to give us three towers, one battling round. Well, technically, I think it's six towers, because two per tower, two battling rams. We Ooh. find you worthy of benefiting from our prosperity. Uh... No. I'm going to say no just for the one turn. We're going to reject it. I want to take one province. An alliance would truly benefit us all. I'm happy to get a non-aggression pack with that. But I want to take this settlement and then we'll make peace with uh, the Latin Empire. They started this war. We're going to get something out of it. 1,500 gold. It's just not worth it. Okay. We're good to go there. Settlement strength is all down there. We're going to continue sieging just for the time being while I can just work out everything else. Okay, so by the looks of it, who are you guys? Ah, you're the empire over there and you're the empire there. So that's a new army. So that could have actually lost. By the looks of it, they may be in a bit of trouble. Which is fine by me. This just gives us something to aim for. Everything else is looking fine. Public order's all good. We've got, it. like I said, still a bit of gold. That's bringing in, what is it, 449 per turn. Okay. 
Well, I'm going to actually leave the episode there, guys, because this battle is going to take quite a long time, and I think it's just going to make the episode a bit too long for my liking. So we're going to just shorten this episode, and then next episode we'll get stuck straight into this battle. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We didn't do a whole lot. We're just getting into position. Uh, if you guys did, as always, hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. And if you guys haven't done already and enjoyed this series, please subscribe. It helps out the channel a lot. So until then, you guys have a good one. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye for now.